Alright. What is going on, guys? K Dog Skin all coming back at you with another episode of my uh almost of my Final Fantasy. No, my Tomb Raider one whoops. Playthrough. Um yeah, actually I need to go back up here. I think that's where I started the level over again. Yes I did. Okay. Um yeah, I'm just gonna remember, I gotta drop down here. Kill the ratty. And push this thing out of the way. Like I said, I don't do the best with puzzles, but I just got, I spent like a half an hour and I only got like not even a quarter of the way through the level before I got just irritated. But like I said, then I, um, huge shout out to uh, Badass Games, as I said, I've been actually, he's like a Tomb Raider savant. So he has uh, a no med pack, no save, no whatever run. Uh, plus he does walkthroughs for him too. So it's like, oh, okay. I kind of like that notion. Guess my feed does show immediately for streams. <laughs> All right, here is the main area of the cistern. Some friends in the water down here. Alright, I want to get down here. I just want to kind of mosey through this level here. Oh, God. So we got a couple rats. As I said, we got a couple crocodiles down here. Get him? I doubt it. Nope, we didn't. Only thing I hate about the crocodiles in this area is they really one bullet would have ended that. But all right. Um. All right, there's a secret down here. Yeah, over this way. down here, grab the uh, magnum clips. And that comes out here. That little spot there will come we'll go through later. We gotta go this way. We have one more level in the um, St. Francis levels. Which is the, uh, the Tomb of Tehokan. At the end of that level, um, there's a uh, new kind of enemy that it's a it's a prelude to what we'll be dealing with uh, uh, what's to come. Excited to get to start Final Fantasy X on Monday. Hell yeah. Final Fantasy uh, X. Uh, it's really hard for me to put like, my favorite Final Fantasy game, either 10 or 12. I've, I've done more in 12, but... 10 has such a great story. So does 12, for that matter, but... Right, grab the rusty key. There's uh, two rusty keys, two silver keys, and a gold key in the level. Yeah, tens. Like I said, yeah. It's if if tens one, twelve is one a. Like I said, I I can't put one above the other. Look, at that, I love the the remasters of Puddle. Um, I like the switch of the party members on the fly. Absolutely. That's one thing that that's another reason I love twelve so much is because twelve is a similar, a similar thing, but. All right, so we pop the rat from up above. Oh, God, that was almost dangerous. Come over here. 
And I do believe we have to go this way first. Because the rusty key goes there. There's a rusty key that goes on that door as well. But we have to raise the water level before we can get that one. Got the HD remaster for both the, uh, the PS3 and the PC. Hell yeah. Oh. Monkeys or gorillas. Now, for whatever reason, uh, Pierre, who we've been chasing after for a while, once you come up here, he spawns. And again, camera is my biggest enemy in this game. Remaster what? I think he's referring to the remaster of Final Fantasy X. Like I said, his health bar disappears. I don't know why he... Okay, he's gone. I don't know why he just constantly... Despite his health bar being gone, he just constantly stays around. I don't get it. But The next level, we get to end him once and for all. So... Come up here, and... There's some magnet clips there, but I swear I have tried... We're going to save it when we get over here, because I'm determined to do this. Because when Badass Games does this, he does this so, like, effortlessly. So just angle yourself towards it. And I, I can never hit this the spot like he can. Zombies, ooh, spooky. Ten two, I I don't want to say I dislike ten two, but whoa, okay, was not expecting that. I'll try this one more time, and if I can't get it, I'm really not going to worry about these things. I just yeah, I can't figure out how to get those, but whatever. Like I said, not a big deal. I was excited for 10 2. I, I thought 10 2 was going to be. I mean, if you get the perfect ending, Yuna and Tidus are reunited, but. I don't know. I just. I, I love what they tried to do, just wasn't a fan of the execution. Uh, mindless, exactly. I Yeah, I could not agree more with that. All right, so down here we have some Crocs. I've uh, never seen anyone finish it, so no clue. Uh, yeah. Did we get it? We didn't. There's actually a third crocodile. But you have to make him spawn. Literally just spawned right there. Come up here. Easy way to deal with these things. Got him. So all three of these crocs dead. Croc. Through here, there's going to be a bat. Or, I'm sorry, not a bat, a rat. Bat, rat, whatevs. But there's a large med pack. They give you plenty of med packs in this game. Look at that. I'm going to go ahead and use a small one just because we got about that. Uh, easy way to deal... Easy way to deal with anything without guns. Holly <laughs> says, hey, don't be hating on Tin 2. Like I said, it's not that I hate Ten Two. I, I I like I I like the game. I I just I just feel that the execution of Ten Two lacks a little bit. Like I said, the story lacks a little bit. But I love the fact that Yuna came back. I love the fact that she uh, joined the Goal Wings. I swear, like every time I hear Riku say the word Goal Wings. It just makes me want to cringe, but 
Have I finished it yet? Um, you know, I started a play a playthrough of Final Fantasy. I don't know if I ever did finish it. If I'm if I'm being completely honest with you. Right, come on here. We have ugh, rats. <coughs> rats and spikes. Oh crap. Okay, I didn't die. Thank God. I think it both rats though, so that's good. Another rat down here. Oh god. Got it. Three, four shots with the rat for the rats. There we have our first silver key. Do not fall into this water. Please don't do that. Um, if you do, you have one hellacious backtrack to do. There's a lot of things I missed in it, and I, I think that's kind of why I, I don't want to say I gave up my playthrough of it, but I actually kind of forgot about it. Because there was a lot of things in the game I forgot to do and forgot to pick up. But, I mean, I wouldn't mind going back to it just for, you know, old, for old time's sake. But <laughs> I told myself I really can't really do anything else with Final Fantasy until I finish up 6. And I promise you guys, I will finish up 6 eventually. <laughs> Being very careful. You fall from this height, you will die. So, just be very careful. Again, as you make your way down, there's going to be another rat that spawns. Okay. Again, be very careful. Do not fall in that water. Once you grab the key, it's going to... It's going to... Uh, it's going to spawn... Lar um, not Larson, the other guy, Pierre. Right there, as I'm literally walking right into him. I'm just going to leave Pierre. I'm taking a crap ton of damage. Way more damage than I needed to take. Holy hell. That was ridiculous. Alright. As we come up here, um, you will see that there's a lever that we need to pull. Uh, however, we need to raise the water level in the cistern to do that. All right, so I'm going to show you guys how to do that. We're going to leave Pierre. And then we're going to take this out. Remember how I mentioned to you guys when we got the first secret, we were going to go through that eventually. Well, now is the time. All right. So, moving on. We're going to go back the way we came. Um, and then I believe, instead of going there, I need to go this way. Ooh, boy. Yeah, I could never do a walkthrough of the game, just because, like I said, I... But... Alright, now we're going to go up into here. This is, and this is actually what I meant. I'm going to save it right here, as a matter of fact. So... We're actually going to raise the water level in the cistern, all right? Be careful. Don't jump in the water. If we throw this lever here, it will raise the water level in the cistern, all right? Which is what we want to do. But before we proceed, a couple things... <clears throat> excuse me. A couple things I want to... My God, I don't know where the hell that came from, but... <clears throat> Alright, um, I'm gonna come up here. Up here, I think? Yes. There's a small med pack up here. And our second secret is up here as well. Right up here. Nice. Uh, there's a lot of little things that just lower your percent. Oh, absolutely. Like, if you don't talk to this NPC, you lose two uh, two tenths of a percentage point. And that could literally make the difference between getting 100% or not. Literally. All right, I'm going to save it here because this is a little bit of a tricky jump. Not really, but knowing me, I'd screw it up. There we go. And we have uh, two more boxes of shotgun shells, too. So make sure we grab those. 
Yeah, this is uh, the furthest I've gotten. We, were, I've been live for 15 minutes, and this is the fur the furthest I've gotten in the level, at least on stream. Ooh, ooh, took a lot more damage than I wanted to. That's all right. We got plenty of medicine packs. Not really too worried about it. Um, and I do believe there's one more pickup to grab. You know, we got five people in the chat. Welcome in, all of you. Great to see everybody. We have another med pack up here I want to grab. At least you didn't die. I know, right? I know. And then either tonight or probably, to well, some more shotgun shells. I'll watch uh, Badass Games. He'll, he'll, I'll watch him do the, uh, the Tomb of Tehokan. And then I can just commemorate that to memory and play. So you go, oh, God. Living on the edge. All right, dive into the water. There's going to be a rat. Uh, nibbling at us. Here we go. Still need, get, still need to get Ultimate Chicken Horse. I think I have Uno. We got more rats up here, so let's go ahead and take care of these things. I am. I am. That's why I took the other video down. <laughs> Thought there was another rat. Well, plus, it also helps I know where to go now. Well, not there. <laughs> Didn't mean to fall in the water, but. Tell you what, been, I don't know those of you that watch football, I mean, those that are familiar with my channel know that uh, Holly and I did uh, collaborative videos all through, well, through most of the season last year with our picks, and we are going to do picks again this year. But several teams making some uh, big, uh, big offensive uh, and defensive splashes in free agency. We got a silver key. Now we got the other rusty key, so that's pretty awesome. I don't remember if there's anything over. No, there's not. Ooh. Ooh. Got him. Uh, your pick videos were... Uh, well, thank you. I appreciate that. We, uh, like I said, Holly watched me, um, the, uh, the first couple weeks, and then, uh, Holly joined up in, uh, week three, and then we, only thing we didn't do, and I, honest to God, I feel like the reason that we didn't do anything with the Super Bowl is neither one of us gave a shit about the Super Bowl. We did a simulation of the Super Bowl on Madden 24, but we never really did a picks video, because like I said, I don't think Holly and I, nor I cared uh, about the Super Bowl. Um, I didn't even watch the Super Bowl, if I'm being completely honest with you. But now notice how the cistern, like this water level, is all super high now. Which is exactly what we wanted. So we're going to throw this uh, underwater switch that we passed earlier. Because, uh, again, the water level was not high enough, so... Go back. Oh, you're a hockey fan? I, it's not that I don't like hockey. I just... Oh, there we go. There's a switch. We also have some goodies up here, so let's get rid of the rats and... Uh... For the longest time, I was a Colorado Avalanche fan. But... What's really weird is, like, none of the teams that I follow, for those that don't live, I live in central Illinois, and I am not a, all my sports teams are nowhere near Illinois. Well, except Green Bay. The Packers, obviously, are from Wisconsin, but um, I've got a, uh, oh, the Kraken, yeah. The Kraken were actually really good last year. I, they actually almost... 
Uh, minus, I was going to send you my PlayStation information, but you don't want pictures. <laughs> Let's save it again. All right, let's go down here and flip this lever that we couldn't reach earlier, right here. Okay, and that literally opens up a space, or a gate, rather, down here. This is our second silver key, all right? So now, and now we're literally right back to where we were. Back out in this main area. Look at the crocodile. Look at that. Original? Remaster. <laughs> I just love how you can toggle the, the flipping camera at will. at Like, literally at will. Alright, so we're going to come over. This is where the two silver keys go. This is toward... Uh, but I don't want to do that. Oh, I need to go over here. That's right. All right, come over here. And use the other rusty key in this lock here. We're actually almost through the level. Oops. No. I, I know, Laura, sorry. Yeah, if you use the wrong key, Laura will tell you no. She will basically tell you to fuck off. She's like, no, not doing it. At all. Alright. Actually, hold on. Before I get too involved here, I do want to save it because I don't I don't recall right off the top of my head what is down here, but we're gonna save it. This path. There's some spikes there. Um, uh, mum, 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 mum. Where am I going? Up through here. Here we go. Medipack. Medipack, medipack in a dish. And then here is the gold key, which opens up the level exit. And again, right back out here. So now remember this this uh, particular area we couldn't get to. Oh, there's a crocodile. Damn. Lit that some bitch up. All right, yeah, we couldn't access this without the uh, the water level raised, so now we're going to come up here. And then we're going to use our first silver key. Okay. And then use the second silver key. Kind of odd that there's two doors, you know, like that, but... All right, what am I missing? I'm missing one secret. Uh, yeah, we um we took a tour of Lambo, um which was really cool. We actually got to walk through the the players tunnel. Um, that was like literally one of the coolest things ever. Uh, this is the level exit right here. We have to go and unlock this now. But, um, yeah, that was a really good, I mean, especially me being a Packers fan. Um, my wife, not so much a Packers fan. I mean, she, she tries, but, but there's a, you could see there's a gorilla there. I got some shotgun shells now, so let's go ahead and light the uh, gorilla up. And, oh, damn, one shot him. Gotta be secret. <laughs> Alright, use the gold key in the lock, which will open the level exit. Or no, I'm sorry, it doesn't open the... No, 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 I'm sorry, it doesn't open the level exit. I... I fibbed. It opens... Ooh. Damn, saved myself on that one. We have some lions that come out to play. There we go. 
Alright, now we're going to come in here, and uh, this level... Do what? Yeah, I love you more about it. Yeah, secret in the general chat. Why did I just re... Are you kidding me? God bless America. I reloaded instead of saved it. This is... God bless America. I was trying to save it, and I ended up reloading it by mistake. Ah. Uh, that was just dumb. God damn it. I hate when I, like... Okay, seriously, where the hell do I go? All right, let me get some air before I die. I cannot believe I did that. That was literally at the at the end of the level. And like an idiot, like I said, just wasn't paying attention. God, this camera is so inept. This is true, George. I will give you that. What in the hell? I swear to God, the biggest detriment to this goddamn game is the camera. I'm sorry, no, the biggest detriment is the controls. Then it's the camera. I don't know how I get so lost right here. I literally can't do... anything. I just came down... Again, God damn it. There we go. Good lord. Like I said, the camera is just such an ass. Now, this is going by a million times better than the, uh, the last time, but... Come here. Did I get him? Yeah, we got him. All right. I just, God, I just cannot believe I did that. Like, really? Like, what? Like George said, only lost a few minutes of footage, not like an hour. That might have been my, like, I don't want to say, like, what put me over the top, but, like, if I would have, like, not saved it the entire level and then done that, yeah, I would have been like, dude, no. I think the last secret is uh, is in that room I was literally just in before I re accidentally reloaded. It's like under a collapsible floor panel or something. Right. Got my shoddy again. Now, how did one shot kill him last time, but it took two shots at this time? I, I don't know. Uh, system, my name is there, too. Nice. Oh, crap, my stuff's kicking in. Actually, I really don't need my shotgun if I'm going to take the, the lions out from afar. a hang drop that usually first one there we go I was like I knew I had both of them down all right let's try this again this time however let's save not load save there we go um I don't think it's that one might be the no not that one this one 
know if that's a secret or maybe it's not a secret. Maybe it's not. Um, this switch is a dick move. I'm gonna just throw it just to show you what it does. It opens that door, which all it does is release a couple lions out here. It has no bearing on it's just it's a red herring switch. Three lines ahead. It is three lines. Ooh. Dude, you would have you know how much of a dick you would have been had you like pushed me into those spikes? Like I would have like metaphorically punched you. In your lion face. I don't think there's anything in here. Maybe there is. Uh, really? That just shuts. Yeah, that just shuts the door. Yeah, that switch is a complete dick. Yeah, literally nothing in the room other than, uh, like I said, three lions that. Try to kill you. All right. I believe we just move this. No, we don't. Um, okay, hang on. Because I didn't get to this point. Hang on. Hang on. I'm going to bring up my guide. Bear with me. Hang on. Okay, there is a pull out like is it am I standing on it? No. Okay, what is okay, hang on. Where is this pullable block? Like seriously. I missed the other secret. I don't know where... The, oh, wait, it might be. Walk up here? Oh, good lord. Okay. Before pulling the lever, run around to the back right and pull out the block once. Are you kidding me right now? There's no way to... Oh, come on. This guide is absolute fucking garbage. It does not tell you a fucking thing. Unbelievable. Hang on a minute. Because, again, can't figure anything out on my own. Unfucking believable Badass games. Tomb Raider 1, because I'm a worthless piece of shit. God, I fucking hate this game. I, I don't know why I'm playing it. Really? Again, how the hell are you supposed to know this? Unless you know the game, which I clearly don't. It's this pullable block. Unreal. Pull this one thing out. I think you have to pull it out twice. Twice. 
like I said, you know what? Not pretty, but we passed it. That's all that matters. And then there we go. There's the cistern. Missed one secret. Not a big deal. Uh, 21 to 28 pickups. Not terrible. We got through the level. That's all that matters. All right. So we're going to come swim through here. You said the same thing about uh, Liza P. I did. And I ended up beat well. And I, unbeknownst to me, my fight with the Nameless Puppet got cut off. Um, not that you guys missed much, because he kicked my ass. But, right. That's not a lever? Are you kidding me? That's, that's a switch, but... Are you kidding me? Oh, this sucks. Okay, there we go. It might. You know, I, it, sometimes it does. It truly does. I'm just trying to get to it. I don't want to save it in the water. I want to be on dry land when I save. That's just a pet peeve, I guess. Yeah, I can't you I can't pull that because I'm not Are you seriously fucking with me? Like in the very first 30 seconds I can't figure out where the fuck to go. This game is inept. This is insane. Unfucking real. I gotta be missing something stupid. What the fuck's this piece of shit guy that is absolute garbage? Because I can't. I don't give a fuck about ads. Eat a bag of dicks. Uh, you know how the game the surface. Okay, again, God, this. Fucking camera is just ass. You literally can't do shit here. After dropping down into the water from the last level, continue down the tunnel. A gate is closed at the end, so you'll need to turn off to pull the switch. That is even worded stupidly. Oh, I hate this fucking game. Absolute ass. I said there was a switch on the wall or something. Seriously, didn't see this was here. Unbelievable. Okay, it sounds like it lowered the water level. And it did. Okay, now I can flip that other switch, but... Alright, there we go. Yep, now we can throw that switch. Anyway, guys, welcome to the Tomb of Tahoka. That took three and a half minutes to freaking figure that out. But anyway, guys, I'm going to get this part wrapped up so I can get my happy butt to bed. I want to thank you guys so very much for watching. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you've not done so already. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you would, pretty please. It does help the channel grow. And I will catch you guys tomorrow with some more Shining Force 2 and some more Tomb Raider 1 Remastered. Take care.